Now it's time for Mr. Fix-It, powered by your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Chevy dealers. Well, 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 oh, look at Lou. Uh, uh -oh. Showing off again. You know, there's a little uh, a little known fact about Mr. Fix-It. There was a time in my life where I could do the splits. Really? Just drop yeah. down right on the floor and do the splits. Men traditionally are not flexible. Me, right. I'm still very flexible. Really? Let's I mean, see. I would have to work on it right now. No, I can't. No. <laughs> Let's see. But Put a leg no, right I, over the back of your head. I could. I, I No. I, I, oh, he's um, not wearing oh, pants. Wait, what? You wearing, what are you wearing? <laughs> How come no pants today? I'm at home. Don't fall. <laughs> Paul, like you don't like you wear pants at home. Right, you're right. I don't. Wow. <laughs> Boy, let's get to what he's uh, talking about today. Heat and humidity really coming on strong oh my God, today. It's Hello. Gonna be so, <laughs> don't it is you know be it? So, it's going to be so hot today. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we can get right to it. Um, all right. I do. I am concerned that sun and that heat is coming, and there's going to be uh, all the heating people are going to be so busy now with no cooling calls today. So let's get the fans going. The box fans are. I see them at the stores. They're available. These things are 20 bucks and move them around the house if you can to try and get some air movement. That certainly will be helpful. If you've got a ceiling fan, get all those going. If you turned them the other way, you wanna go counterclockwise, so now we start pushing the air down. Get into the furnace area, and uh, this is where we need to check that filter. Chances are nobody's looked at those since the winter, and if they are clogged, this system is gonna work really hard. Go get a brand new filter and put that into the slot. If you can't get to a, a filter, you can keep that out and run it for a couple days without a filter. It's not the end of the world. This is the condensing unit outside. If it looks like this, where it's got all that debris and uh, grass clippings, whatever, it's like trying to get a thick milkshake out of a little straw. You need to wipe all that down with a broom or a hose and get that nice and clean or it'll save you time. Now this is something I like, if you've got a big room in your house, one of the issues is with high ceilings is trying to keep this cool. The advent of these things called split systems is something in the HVAC world to think about if you can never get a room cool. These cartridges go right on the wall and there's a condensing unit outside and you can spot condition a larger room with one of these units. They both do heating and cooling and can be a solution. They started around $3,000 installed and if that that doesn't work and you can't get cooler, then what I would do is put the kiddie pool outside, fill it up with cold water, find a couple of neighborhood kids and say, hey, can I come in there with you and cool yourself off today? All right, Lou, thanks a lot. You can check out uh, House Smarts on Saturday afternoons on WGN at 3.30. Lou's also on WGN Radio with his show House Smarts Radio. Catch it Saturday morning, 6 to 10 a.m. Have a good weekend.